Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we'll create a website on Squarespace completely from scratch. Make sure to watch this video till the very end so you won't make any mistakes. So if you're new to this platform, you'll have to create an account. But as for me, I just simply need to click on get started. You can easily create a separate account or you can create it with uh, your uh, like Gmail, it will be much easier. And here we are on our creational page. Just simply click on build your own website. If you don't want to use templates designed uh, for just simple customers, as you can see, all of them are completely free. So we don't have to pay. Click on build your own template in the right side to start creating our own template. Uh, here we can easily use uh, different variations of um, pages and uh, sections we'd like to see on our website. So let's click on let's go. And firstly, we need to create the name. So basically, it may take a little time to set up everything. But now we need to um, answer the question, what is your site called? Let it be like um, website from scratch. Next. Uh, after that, uh, on this page here, we need to build our homepage. So the first page uh, people will see, then they will visit our website. So we have like six or seven options. Uh, we need to add insert section. As you can see, we have uh, six templates here. I'm going to use this one. As for me, this is definitely the best variant. And also what is interesting is that, for example, if you don't want to add products on our page, let's say that we want to create portfolio website, blog website or something like this, we don't have to add it. So in order to like don't add, just simply do not choose something or you can like click on it once more. And as you can see, it will be automatically deleted as for us. So I would like to add the survive section instead of products. Let's say that we want to add maybe yoga classes or something like this. So basically, after that, we need to add some additional information. I would like to use this variant here. Then social section, let's be like a simple area like this. And then forms section. As I said, you don't have to add all the pages, all the sections. You can just simply use and add what do you want. I'm going to use this feature, this footer right up here. Let's click on next. And then we need to add the pages on our website. As you can see, we have like four options, but a little bit later, we'll be able to add some additional templates, additional pages. I'll show you how to do it. So let's say that we want to add about page and contact. Let's click on next. And now uh, pre last uh, step is to choose a color palette. So we have a lot of uh, different color palettes we can use. And you need to know that um, color palette, it's like important to combine them with images with add our website. So if we'll add like bright um, images, we need to use bright palette. If we'd like to add some dark color palette to dark images we'll, we have to use like for example monochromatic or something like this let's say that well, i'd like to use this one here let's click on next and the last step we need to choose a font and here i recommend you to use this one it's like really simple and really easy to read to understand to interact with for like portfolios blog website or online stores it's really really good Let's click on next and in a few seconds everything will be saved and this like created template will be used as a template for our website. So now all we need to do is just simply wait and then we need to like add our own content inside. And what's really interesting is that Squarespace provides us the opportunity to personalize our homepage text with uh, Squarespace AI, they created like their own AI to 
like fill all the articles, some um, paragraphs and so on. In my case, I'm going to click on skip, but you can click on continue and to use it to fill all the things. I would like to set up it by myself. So here we are on our simple dashboard. And now I want to show you how to interact with pages. So if you'll click on website in the left side menu, we'll be able to see all the pages we have on our website. So here we need to click on plus to add something new. And as you can see, we can add blank page, page layout, scheduling stuff, blog, store, portfolio, events, videos, courses, and so on. Depends on your choice. Also, we can delete all the things. And now, uh, what's like uh, interesting about creating uh, Squarespace websites from scratch is that all the next steps are the same as uh, we'd like to if we'd like to use a template. So now we just simply need to click on edit and on our editor, we need to interact with the content inside. So we can move all the elements, uh, we can interact with images. So what's like really um, good about creating website from scratch is that we can easily add the sections and pages we need. And also we can use uh, like color palette and font pack we need to see on our website. And it's pretty cool. So let's say we want to add some social links, click on edit. And here we can add like Facebook, like YouTube or some other platforms. And now it's on you to add content to fill all the things. Uh, you can find more in-depth tutorials about interacting with editor on Squarespace on my channel or on other YouTube channels. Nothing hard, just simply Google uh, for it or search for it on YouTube. Uh, I'm going to show you one more interesting thing is that uh, instead of like only editing content, we can also interact with some more information. For example, if you want to add an online store, you can add products, manage your orders, find some discounts uh, and so on. On marketing area, you can uh, create email campaigns, use some other marketing tools. Like as you can see, Metapixel CEO stuff if you want to optimize your website for CEO. And also we can find some interact, uh, like interesting analytics on a traffic page, analyze traffic sources, traffic itself, search keywords, engagement, sales, and so on. If we'll speak about um, paid plans on Squarespace, we can see that they have a lot of uh, plans they can provide us personal, business, basic commerce and advanced commerce. And it's on you. What would you like to choose? Honestly, I recommend you to try it uh, without like paying so you can easily create a, middle, a website. But if you want to see some additional features, you can find these like comparison right up here. And as you can see, the most popular is a business plan, but of course you can use like basic commerce, advanced commerce, personal, it's only on you. So yeah, this is uh, definitely the best way and the easiest way of how to interact with uh, Squarespace in terms of creating a website from scratch. Hope this video helped you out. Leave a like, subscribe and goodbye guys.